Ben Affleck and Jennifer Garner's co-parenting dynamic is still awesome, even with Enida Armas in the mix. While some families have been torn apart with the stresses of quarantine and COVID life, exes Ben Affleck and Jennifer Garner are happy and doing better than ever as they adapt to a new dynamic with Ben's girlfriend Anita Armas now in the mix. The Alisters, who you'll remember split in 2015 after 10 years of marriage, are finally seeing eye to eye when it comes to their three children, Violet, 15, Serafina, 11, and Samuel. 8, a source telling E.T. They're, getting along so well and are often communicating because of their co-parenting dynamic. Even the addition of the actor's new girlfriend hasn't thrown a wrench in the joyful family atmosphere. The insider elaborated. Anna understands the situation and is close with their kids, gets along with them and loves them. Anna and Ben spend a lot of time together when they are both in town. Amazing. We love to see a happy ending to such a fraught love story. The hashtag pretend cooking show star and good will hunting lead have come a long way since their divorce was finalized in 2018, Affleck admitting at the time. I would love to have a relationship that is deeply meaningful and one to which I could be deeply committed. When asked what he was looking for in his next partner, he revealed. I don't know, trust, and care, and mutual respect and all the sort of usual stuff. But I think that's a big part of what makes life satisfying and interesting. It sort of happens when it happens, though. It's not the thing you can force. Two years later and it looks like he's finally found his match. When the new happy couple, who met on the set of Deep Water last fall and sparked romance rumors just as the world was ending as we knew it, aren't mingling with the kids. The confidant explained they keep busy together, divulging. Anna loves how Ben has been focused on being healthy and getting in shape. They do workouts and take walks together and she tries to eat healthy too. Lols. We try too, but it doesn't always work. So happy this family is doing well. There's nothing better than strong co-parents or second chances at happily ever after. Thoughts on all of this, precious readers?